I did some braids in my locks and I'm taking them out, but a friend just posted a picture. She's a teacher and she the paper got some doodles on it and she was super excited to share the doodles on. And it reminded me of a time, well, so in high, like all throughout high school, I doodled on every, like everything, every notes were doodled on, like um, church notes for confirmation stuff had, like was mostly pictures. I, for a while, took notes purely in pictures. Um, but then it, like, and I've, I still do that. Like during church and stuff, I'll, do as much drawing as I do words but then also in my art notebooks I do as much writing and like word bubbling as I do pictures so it's <laughs> I don't know my brain is weird I feel like but uh okay I'm gonna make sure it's okay but anyways at one time there was a for a final in uh college in a math class I like so I did not love math I stopped doing math homework in 10th grade long story but um, and a teacher told me I was dumb, and so I was sad, and I was like, fine, I'll never do homework again. And so, so I've not done math homework since 10th grade. And I, some years struggled, some years didn't. But in college, so, so for college, I tested out a math for art students. Um, but I had to take, like, a, just, I had to get just a math credit. And, um, and so I took, like, the easiest class you can take. And it was basically a review. And so I, um, like, it was not that difficult. But um, but on the and homework wasn't graded in college. But on the final exam, I did like I don't remember. I think I had to get like five percent or something. Like I just had to take it. But I I did fine on it. But um, I spent like most of my time doing doodles, and I did like an entire stick person. <laughs> um, like it was like all stick people cartoons, and so like I, all I remember was that like there were people around the top, and like they went down the side of the page like dancing and stuff. And then I did one that was on a tire swing. And when I got the paper back, he like, we, I got along with the professor well, um, but uh, he laughed. <laughs> so was, I think he was used to having art students um, in his classes. <laughs> and so it's like, if you get, I think it was like 25 or so, like, I don't know what you have to get certain, certain something on your ACTs in math, which actually math and science are my highest on my ACTs. I struggle with reading and writing, like, and I study with test taking in general. There's a couple tricks I've had. Like one of them was if, if teachers will let me, um, write essay questions out I can I've gotten like nine and ten percent better on tests and average if they let me write essay questions for all of the multiple choice and then like um yeah there's anyways so there you go anyways I wanted to share this with my friend though because it made me laugh